Have I done anything like this before? No. Actually, pre-WSOP, I could not make 10 in a row. So this is a big challenge for me. It's going to be a lot of focus, which is kind of what's most exciting to me about this, is how, where I have to push myself in order to succeed in this challenge. I feel really confident, but I'm also still being realistic to keep, my, keep myself grounded a little bit. But I feel like if I had to throw like a percentage out that I do this, it feels like it's definitely not a coin flip. It's at least 60, 40, 70, 30. Tell me when it hits one. It's one. One? Yeah. yeah. All right. We're rolling. My triceps started to get a little tight because I was starting to overshoot, but I'm extremely confident after a little bit of a break. All I ate today was a granola bar that we're gonna come back and we're gonna give it a good go. To just stop even and be like, okay, where are we at? Because I feel like <laughs> if you know that, that's gonna like, I don't know if that, you're the kind of person who that, you know, that's kind of shit helps you yeah, yeah, yeah. or it scares you. For me, that shit scares me. So I would just like, I would lose it, be like, fuck. 40? Oh, Shit. Uh, like, but I feel like it would it would probably fire you up. I think we can kind of feel, like I can feel where I'm at. Yes. But on average, <laughs> when I, even when I was doing bad, I was hitting 6 to 8, right? Yes, you Like were. towards the end when I was getting tired. Yeah, you weren't consistently hitting 10s. You were like 5, 6, 7. But that's tired, but I can fight off. Ten. So it's... The night of the first day, it's about uh, 10 hours in, and uh, this is the second trip back to the gym now. Uh, we hit 48 earlier today, and uh, we've had some muscle complications that we're working through a little bit, but uh, we're getting a good stretch in. And we're gonna give it another go. We're gonna be here for at least two hours if we don't get it done. Then we're gonna go back, we're gonna rest, we're gonna get ready, and then tomorrow we will have like a three, four hour window uh, to still have another shot at it if we don't get it tonight.
Me and Boise learned this song on the guitar before we left the island. So yeah? Yeah, yeah. It was fun. Alright, so it's like 11 o'clock now. This is our second time here today and I could definitely feel my focus was struggling a bit, maybe a little bit tired. Um, my muscle was a little bit better, but my muscle, my tricep is still bothering, but we have one more shot tomorrow morning. We'll have about three hours to do it, so we gotta go rest. We have three hours to make this happen. It's plenty of time, plenty of time. I'm really happy. Uh, we rested last night. We only shot for a little bit, and uh, our muscles did not seize up last night. I was really nervous that my tricep was just gonna be done and my neck was gonna be done. But when I woke up this morning, I actually, my muscles felt better than yesterday. Yesterday morning when I woke up, my neck was all jacked up and my like right arm and stuff. But today's better, we're here, we're definitely refocused. So, man, we gotta do this. All right, it's 12.05, we have 55 minutes left. Drew is do getting his own rebounds. So we're kind of just like in the background, you know, small steps. Uh, 55 minutes though is a lot of time, so we're gonna let him focus. So we did not make a hundred in a row. We got about a minute left before our 24 hours is up. We made heaps of 25ers today. I think 48, we're gonna have to check tape. But my original statements still stand. This is far from impossible. This is far from impossible. We may have lost a couple hundred bucks to Bill. It was a free roll for 10K. 
I'm not gonna lie, I'm definitely a bit disappointed, but um, I definitely still know it's not impossible. This was an awesome challenge, Bill. Thanks for um, agreeing to do this. Thanks to uh, everybody who doubted me. I fed a lot, lot off of that. We will be coming back to this challenge. So thanks again, everybody who watched. I still believe it was an incredible day. I shot thousands of shots. My arm might fall off, but it's okay, it was still worth it, it was a good sweat. Hope you enjoyed this video, and definitely, always step number one is believe that you can do something, and I promise you, you will get way closer than you ever believed you could, so believe. That have said this is impossible, there's a zero chance that this can happen, you will never do this. And that is gasoline for my fire. It's got me so amped up, and it almost, almost makes doing it to silence people worth more than the actual 10K that I would get for hitting 100 in a row.